My son has a Segway 9Bot Max G30LP scooter that's not charging. When I plug it in, it beeps, but if you look at the display, there's no charging indication. The other way I can tell it's not charging is that the charging brick is showing green, and when it's charging, it should show red. The battery in this unit is different from the ones I've seen in other videos, so I wanted to make a video specifically for this model. Fold it up flip it over on its head and we're going to be taking off this base plate which is secured with T15 Torx screws. That green brick is the battery, that's what we're going to be changing. It's held in by three brackets. Each bracket is secured with a pair of hex screws. There's some tape and zip ties, just remove those. And then on one end of the battery, there are three connectors that need to be undone. At this point, you can wiggle the whole battery out and then slide those brackets off. My battery failed just shy of the 180 day warranty period, so they sent me a new one. If you're looking to buy one on the open market, here are the serial numbers. So the foam on the battery they sent me did not match up with the foam on the existing battery. The foam is protecting the battery from the brackets. I bought some foam off of Amazon, I'll link it in the description, and then redid the foam on the new battery to match the old one. Installing is the reverse operation. Put the battery in, then slide the brackets on, Secure those back with the six hex screws. Then reconnect the three wires that we disconnected earlier. I did not replace the zip ties that I cut earlier. I don't know that it matters, but you could. And then finally put that base plate back on and re-secure those Torx screws. This worked for me first try. Uh, I plugged it in, the battery's charging and, and all's good with the scooter. So good luck with yours.